Hi. Um, you got to have the sound machine on here. We know we've covered that enough, right? Why that is? Um, I hear people in the house. So no, but he's been arrested. It's just all the same. We know. This is like being an Egyptian mummy here. You're just preserved in all your crime. And you can continue to do this, I guess, until you're like, what? In the under, in the other realm or whatever. I have to be careful what I say because literally these meth heads are so fucking whacked out over anyone who threatens their power structure that if you say the wrong adjective, they'll come running. I know, they're really, really desperate humans right now. My hair's a mess, yes. I'm going to bathe, I'm going to do what I need to. Good thing I made that pot roast. Um, this is unbelievable what happened in the United States, but people saw it coming in other nations. This was predictable. So I gotta keep the perspective and stay calm. Why I'm filming is, the noise here is ungodly what they have running down that street. Sorry to interrupt myself here. It's impossible with the noise here to narrate, and we know that. My guidance was solid on that. All they've accomplished with this crazy uh, no city codes that I've written clearly about at any adult, since I've written clearly about it, should not be asking why I'm saying this now. Um, they're tearing up their sidewalks. That's all they accomplish. The sidewalks, excuse me, and the concrete on their streets are being rashed in the city. Yeah. So back to my point. Um, it's really hard to keep a fucking point here. I got the sound machine going. I got massive noise coming over the sound machine through that. Let me try to recall it. It doesn't matter. I'm going to just pick up. And I don't care this is on video. And it doesn't mean I'm fucking cuckoo clock. I need to go back into the back in the back of a hospital. Way back there. And don't let her out. Wow. This is Stasi. This is all Stasi. Don't worry. They're not going to do that. Okay. Um, right. Thank God. It was my guidance. Okay. My guidance is and why I filmed this. This is why I filmed. My guidance is, is to stay here one more day. Do not look for Craig's. Craigslist is a really bad idea. I know that, but I don't know what else to do. I am in such financial hardship. I am, in, excuse me, I'm in such abject poverty. The civilians in the United States will not, no matter what, do their part in helping the other. When you meet a real freedom fighter, that's when the authoritarianism and the totalitarianism really rears up its ugly head. And that's where I sadly had to play my role, but it showed the militaries what was going on. And then of course, historical things happened, these massive protests on and on. I'm not your historian, I'm an adult and so are you. You go ahead and research and reflect on what's happened the last four years. Don't make me do it every Twitter video. All right, so they know, the militaries know, all right? And so, but I'm still in this really bad predicament. I cannot rely on any United States people to offer any help, any job or suitable housing. In fact, they use everything they can as a means to deny, deny, leaving the God of the dead, a woman, and do it all by yourself, lady. Do it all by yourself in the meantime. And while we're pushing you into the gutter and leaving you for dead, you're going to be doing that by yourself too because you went against our totalitarianism, our authoritarianism mind state, which I told you in synopsis is to be a rich white American. This, if you threaten, they will kill you for here. All right, they will fucking get a little gun at any fucking Walmart and come up and shoot you. This other country saw as predictable. You feed this kind of doctrine to millions of people. This is the result. All right, so I, in guidance, I'm told, don't do, don't do Craigslist. 
or or, or these apartment sites because mommy you really don't know what to do you're so fucking poor where do you start um stay right here get the guy for mold get him for everything you can and i figure since i'm staying right here i should probably next week get on down to city civil court this i can't do but i take my actions on a daily basis because we're a failed state and that's all i need to say with that in a failed state when you're living through that kind of thing which is a thing is not the right word my advice since i've done it is just take your life on a daily basis especially if you're all by yourself through it and nobody's offering you any help do you know what this is fucking like for anybody and i'm a chick I'm just fucking blown away. And then don't forget the kind of house I'm in. How illegal and the crimes. No way, man. I know. I know. And to this day, nobody wants to hear about it? No, Heidi. Because this to them is okay. The U.S. civilians and the politicians, when our sovereign territory, in uh, whatever the word, gets handed to Iran, handed to Putin of the Russian mob, they're actually fine with that. They have no loyalty for the flag. The flag to them is their bank account, the drug account, and their orgasm. Their orgasm that they can have if they want it with a kid, it's not your business. They have the right, I want to have sex with that seven-year-old. That's where this is going. This United States is going there at hyperbolic speed. But this is what I predict. I don't think they'll get there. I think there's other countries that have had enough of being attacked. And this is where I'm going to stop because I can't speak about military attacks when I'm not a, 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 a military official and it doesn't do it justice. All right. It doesn't. But that's where this is going. Putin, the United States KKK and so on and so forth have, let's just say this, pissed off too many other countries. All right. God bless America. Say goodbye.